gewählt haben, und wir bitte This call get, is back, now being recorded. get back to the recorded video and learn from it. That is what I just said. Maybe you didn't get what I said very well. I, um, it's recording now, and I want to say officially welcome to this session. Um, what I talk about recording, I say that we record every session and it becomes our video library. What do we mean by video library? Where you can go back and look about what we've done in the past over again and again and again. We have a course portal where you are going to be, you know, enrolled in. Everybody will have access to our course portal. And this is where we make these videos available. Even the lecture notes and the video notes, they are made available within the course portal for you to assess. You know, even the quizzes, assignment is going to be via the course portal. That is where we manage everything we do. So you have a login where you can log in anytime you want to assess all the videos we recorded. So I don't know if this have addressed what you want to say. Yes, in part though, because I, I felt that maybe those that there are times that one may have to download this information. Should in case other time you are not having a good data or the network is bad, you may not be able to access YouTube. We don't share it that way. That is how we do here. We make sure everybody have access to the course portal. We've been doing it over the years and people are very happy. So it's okay. If it's okay by the whole participants, I'm okay. I'm fine with it. There's no trouble about that. Okay. Okay, Mr. Gosson, tell us more about yourself. Good. Um I'm Gosson by name. Um I graduated as a business management. Uh, have but um, I've been a manager of warehouse for many years, barely for 15 years, and uh, presently, uh, due to taking some professional courses and working as a chartered accountant. But when I was introduced to equi class, from equi class to yours, because I want to actually diversify my profession into IT, so that is what brought me here. But before now, I always yearn for business analysis uh, but uh, i've never had the opportunity to uh, uh, enroll for it because of the cost attached to it before now so when i had this opportunity i said okay it's good to explore so that is why i'm here okay thank you uh, don't worry um we evolve here we listen to our students but try what we're doing first if it's not working then we can try what you are suggesting. Um, we have um, Joanne Kano. Uh, let's visit some ladies here, hear from them. Well, good evening, everybody. My name is Joan. Um, I am a HR practitioner, but I pivoted into healthcare management, currently working as a carer. Um, I was introduced to this class through a friend of mine that attended a quiz class. And because I already said I was, you know, interested in project management, business analysis. So when I saw this opportunity, I jumped on it. So. Okay. That's good. And uh, we'll have uh, Esther Adeyefa. Hello, Mr. Charles. Good evening, everyone from Nigeria. Good evening. So um, my name is Esther. I am a customer success specialist. Currently, I work with ALX, um, Africa Leadership. Um, I asked after i i intentionally went for this course myself i asked equi because yeah i wanted to build myself 
be better and um i know this is an opportunity to do that and i cannot wait to learn from you mr charles as well as everyone i plan to be as proactive as possible and um willing to just meet people who are willing to learn and grow together thank okay. you yeah thank you i can see some people are raising their hands and to be honest with you um we can't continue with introduction it's going to eat up every day everything we are going to do today but what we do is that as we are you know moving into the the program we get to know um each other better or if you have a, a question pressing question that you want to find out something or there's some issue you want to address i would suggest you keep it maybe after the every after every session i give opportunity for question and answer uh, within this period maybe i will give you opportunity to you know ask any kind of question but let's make it snappy because if, if everybody i know everybody will want to talk to express yourself it's not like i'm depriving you that but we are many you can see here we are up to 174 logged into this class and we even have other people that have been joined so um thank you everybody and thank you those who have spoken on behalf of others and thank you for um your patience if if you really wanted to talk and you didn't have this opportunity to talk the opportunity is gonna come this is a program where we are going to be here for the next three to four months so we have to be friends even if you don't like me maybe you have to try as much as you can to like me because there is no two ways about it and i've got to like everybody here because we are going to be here stuck together for the next and even after then i like you to still be my friend so thank you for this um brief introduction and let's get to understand how this program is structured and after then i will show you um one or two like course portal where you are going to be enrolled um and then that is going to be the central place where you are going to assess all the materials and again every program we do we have um internship attached to it so we are like i say we have um i'm a serial entrepreneur we have companies we are going to these are part of the things we are going to introduce as we are progressing so let's get started let me start sharing my screen i will do a brief presentation and after my presentation I'll come back and you start asking questions. And uh, today is not for any kind of lecture, it's just kind of induction. Induction is trying to tell you everything you need to know before you go into the real um, lectures. Okay, here we have done the introduction. So uh, let's look at the brief overview of this uh, program. I hope you are seeing my screen, I hope. So this is a four months bootcamp offered by Digital Technology Business School in collaboration with Niara's platform. Equip with, this is to equip fresh graduate career changers with the skills to thrive, thrive in the project management and business analysis role. So this is for project management and this is for business 
analysis is kind of hybrid, but at the end of it, you have to choose one, have to choose one, either you choose project management or you choose business analysis. But still you have opportunity to be part of the whole training experience, everything about project management, experience everything about business analysis, then explore yourself, search yourself, and look for your strength, inner strength. What makes you happy? Which area do you think you can thrive better? It doesn't matter whether you choose project management or you, whether you choose to be a project manager or to be a business analyst. The pay range is the same thing. What they pay project manager is almost what they pay business analyst. So if you choose, it, let it be based on your passion. But the main thing here is that project management or a project manager is more like a leadership role. You are a leader. And business analyst is a, a changer, a game changer, a problem solver. You solve problems. You, you, if you have passion in solving problems, driving change, then go for uh, business analysis. If you have passion for leadership, very organized, influenced, charismatic, go for project uh, management, be a project manager. Me, I, I drive joy in solving problems. I drive joy in driving change. And that's why over the years, I try, and even though I'm getting a lot of project manager roles, but I love it being business analyst. It's a bit technical, more than project manager, role but i love it you know but both of them are good it's not something you cannot do as a matter of fact you know me i studied finance but i'm doing this now so don't get discouraged by any kind of technique it's not technique it's not technique both of them doesn't involve any kind of coding because i know at this point that might be your fear your challenge how can i at this point start coding as a matter of fact, it was my fear as well, but I like to conquer my fear and I've conquered that fear. I jumped into programming, started programming, and I became a programmer. Although I've not been working professionally as a, a, a developer, but I, do, I use it in my private business and it's really, really helping me. You know, I can only do one thing at a time. I only do cybersecurity. I've done so many of all these rules, better analysis. So many of these rules, you cannot do everything at the same time. You know, you know that's why you have to explore yourself and search for what makes you happy. Like I said, even if I don't get paid again, I will still be doing this because it has become part of my life and it gives me joy. So that is the way it's going to be. So the collaboration here is going to be, we are the Digital Technology Business School. We do the training. We have the boot camp. Then your internship is going to be in a platform called Miara's, where we are going to look at immediately after this. So look at the cost structure. The program is divided into two. First one is the foundational training, which is going to be for one month. And within this foundational training, we are going to have intensive one month, trying to build a strong foundation for you in project management and business analysis methodologies. This is going to be through intensive lectures, group, activities, case studies that will equip you with the essential skills. Then after this one month training, then we have to go into the phase two, and that is going to be a hands-on experience, live project and implementation, where you have the opportunity to practice everything you'll be learning. So participants will apply their learning 
in a real life setting by working on live projects within Miara's platform. In our ongoing projects, our students are working on a, uh, a company called Gokabu. Gokabu is um, application platform for ride sharing and delivery sharing, ride sharing, bidding and sharing. So it's kind of logistics application. But this time around, you guys are going to be working on a special social media platform weaved up with uh, an e-commerce activity, like a platform, which we are going to look into very soon. So the project, um, the live project will be number one, Niara's platform extension develop and execute a project plan for Niara's platform extension into new markets or user demographics. Then we we'll try as much as we can. There is no time, it's just a short period of time. Um, this three months for a pro live project is not enough for you to do so many projects. So, but we we'll try as much as we can to make sure you capture at least two projects you can put in your portfolio or in your work experience. So one is going to be a core project management activity, and the other one is going to be a software implementation. So the next is going to be, the next project is going to be ERP implementation project. What is ERP? ERP is enterprise resource planning. Every company around the world anywhere you can think of it they make use of enterprise resource planning and most of the vendors big vendors this is where we're going to concentrate we have uh, microsoft we have sap we have oracle so many vendors so we are going to select one vendor and get one of their erps implemented so erp is for resource planning organization their resources are their human capital and money and their operational activities that is organizational resources and what do they use to manage all these resources is an application called erp enterprise resource planning application so these are what we are going to do within the live project so let's have a high level uh, view of the whole uh, curriculum. The phase one is going to be project management. We are going to capture topics like project management fundamentals, project life cycle methodology within agile environment and waterfall at this point i want to let you know we have so many projects management methodologies there are so many of them but we are this is not um we are not doing masters here we are doing intensive crash program so we cannot be treating everything although we try as much as we can to capture brief overview of some of others but the areas we are going to concentrate is agile project management and waterfall project management. You know, we know we have extreme programming, we have um, Prince 2, we have uh, so many of them, Six Sigma, so many of them, but our focus is agile and waterfall. Why? Because this is where the organizations are today. If you are looking for job, this is where they are going to demand your skills for mainly in agile environment 80 percent of companies today are migrating they have been in waterfall environments and they are migrating to agile so it's gonna be waterfall and agile so you must understand waterfall and agile if you are joining a company that is migrating you must be able to understand where they are and where they are going so we'll try to treat that very well 
Then we'll capture project uh, planning and schedule, scheduling, project management, uh, risk management, project budgeting, cost control, communication, and stakeholder management. And then we we'll look at tools and techniques in project management. We we'll call it capture essential skills in project management. So these are the things we are going to explore. We would not have time. So it's going to be, we we'll try to, to, to move as fast as we can and to consume as much as we can because we'll try to do this within two weeks. Within two weeks. So it's going to be intensive. Then after project management, we jump into um, business analysis. And within the business analysis, we are going to explore business analysis fundamentals. We are going to look at components, techniques in business analysis. We have so many techniques. We try as much as we can to capture so many techniques in business analysis, such as uh, requirement gathering and analysis, user story mapping and prioritization, process mapping and improvement, system analysis and design, process, uh, business process modeling, and others. We have so many of them. In, in, in business in um, requirement analysis, we have so many of them like um, gap analysis, root cause analysis, so many of them. So we'll try as much as we can to cut deep into all this. So this is going to be within two weeks. So two weeks project management, two weeks um, business analysis. Then we jump into uh, the real project where you are going to start exhibiting all these skills trying to manage live projects within groups. And then that is going to be number one is going to be, like I said, number one projects is going to be NERAS platform is, um, expansion. We are going to look at market research and competitor analysis. We are going to use personal development and target audience identification, develop a go-to-market strategy, uh, project management and resource allocation for expansion and creating marketing and communication plan. This is a, going to be an intensive project management that we need to capture using a uh, comprehensive project management plan. Then after that, we are going to start implementation of ERP, Enterprise Resource Planning. So. To do that, we are going to look at understanding the business need and existing system, the ERP system selection and uh, vendor evaluation, data migration and system integration, user training and change management, project monitoring and post implementation uh, review and support, and reporting and performance measurement. That is what we'll try to capture within this uh, section. And then we'll talk about our assessment method. We are going to use quizzes and assignment for our assessment. And then live projects, deliverable reports, presentation, peer evaluation, and project manager evaluation. So. This is the way we are going to be assessing what we are doing. And then essential resources and support. We have online learning platform. Our online learning platform, I talked about it earlier, is our Assess the Digital Technology Business School online learning platform with course materials interactive exercise and video lectures. All these things, I say the video lecture, we call it video library, we can call it video lecture or video library. It's all the collection of what we do here it becomes our library. We store it there. And everybody that is enrolled in this course will have access. You can go there anytime to watch it over again and again and again. 
we equally have nodes within the uh, online learning portal. We have comprehensive study guide, uh, ebook, and template. We are going to share a lot of templates that will help you uh, uh, to kickstart most of the deliverables you are going to work on and equally to build your own personal library because as you are going into this profession so many of you might start working as a freelancer not for company they will freelance a kind of self-employed they will tell you what to do they are not going to pro provide any uh, resources for you you just do it so that's why it's important to provide a lot of template that will help you do that but if you are going to work with so many big companies most of them have templates what you are going to use but it's still good for you to understand uh all these deliverables the templates you can use have it have a feel of it before um going to use any company's own then we'll have dedicated support team our team of uh instructors and advisors will be available to answer questions and provide support throughout the program and industrial networking event participants in this exercise we are going to be having networking exercise like once in a while we have a meetup where people within the same uh, location will come together talk about get to know and talk about what we are doing so we are going to create event for that. And even within our project, we'll try to, you know, uh, create a situation where we are going to have a bit of outdoors, not just uh, um, um, online. So we are going to have a blend of everything. But for um, I'm sorry for some of us that are not uh, uh, based in Nigeria. Uh, we'll try to, to do it anyhow we can do it. but. For those that in Nigeria, we are going to try to create a blended environment where we need to come out. And then career services. We offer career um, guidance, uh, resume and interview prep workshop to help participants land their dream job. As a matter of fact, the current class immediately they finish their project management training i gave them a project coordinator because they are not they are not yet project manager project coordinators are in between the project i can call it assistant project manager so we provide them with a good template a good cv template which i tell them use it to apply for jobs for now and i know that what you've learned already i guarantee you can get you that job so and so many of them didn't believe but they started trying so many of them started sending their cvs and to be honest with you jobs have been raining here within this project coordinator project planner project administrator role which this is what I, I promised them and it started happening. So it's going to happen to you guys as well. Even some of the people here in UK, they have started securing jobs. So many of them are on their interview already. This is just in between. This is just, they've not, we've not even finished and they've started getting jobs. So we try to, like so many of you came to me later asking me, some questions, I'm doing certification, I'm doing, yes, good and fine. I'm not discouraging you to do certification, but to be honest with you, I've done so many certifications. And what gave me to where I am today is not my certification, is my accumulation of experience. How do you document experience you have? What have you done? Document what you have done, that is your portfolio. They don't believe in certification. Even me, that I don't believe in certification because I know a lot of things going on within the certification. We um, uh, get to be satisfied. You know, so many companies in India, you give them money, they will send you a certificate. I'm being honest with you. They've approached me so many times. Just give them money. They will take the exam for you, do everything for you, 
get you your certificate. And so many companies do not believe in certification anymore because of all this fraud going on. So company will prefer you to come and tell them what you can do for them. Tell, convince them what you are bringing on tables. Don't tell them you are chatter this or chatter that or certify it. They are not interested in being honest with you. So that is it. And let's talk about the benefits. Become a job ready, gain the practical skills and industrial knowledge sought by employers in projects, uh, manager and business analyst role. Life project experience, apply your learning in a real world project with a growing social media platform. Network with industrial professional. Build valuable connection with experts in the project management and being enough is good. It's very, very important that you build, try to be a good team player. Try to make friends, connection, networking. It starts from here. It starts now. Don't try to just be connected to me to help you. A lot of jobs are coming on coming to me. A lot of people will come in to tell me, um, send them some of my best students, good and fine. But so many of your, you here, so many of your friends, connection you make here, they are going to help you to get jobs as well. Because so many of you, so many of them will get jobs before you. And you find out that the company where they get the job, they are still looking for people. And that is the networking. They will have to invite you or tell you that, our company is recruiting. So try to be uh, a team member, a good team member. You know, try to be friendly. It's very, very important. Try to be supportive. If you know, try to, if you see your, your team or your colleague or your fellow trainee struggling and you can help out, don't wait for me to come and um, clarify. If you can do that, good and fine. If there is need for you to volunteer, volunteer. So administrative tasks, see anything you can do, do it. It's part of the learning experience. It's not gonna be here. You just uh, a period of three to four months. It's gonna be three, not three to four years. Before you know it, it's gone. And if the friends you make here, because you know you have a reason to be here. As a matter of fact, what you are doing here is very important to you. Meaning that all of you here are like-minded people that can help a can help you and b can help so you have the same agenda so thank you for um your attention to this presentation and if you have any question don't worry i will give you opportunity to ask any kind of question Okay, what I'm gonna do here is to take you to our course portal. This is our course portal. This is our course portal here. So every of you here, this is this is just the front um, front end. Behind the front end, a lot of things are happening within this course portal. It's a very comprehensive course portal you know so we are doing a bit of upgrading and the troubleshooting at the moment but we are going to still be um starting the enrollment soon so if you and um, if you already have an account here all you need to do is click here and you sign in and that's it you sign in and you it will take you to your dashboard and then if you are new join if you do here and you have to sign up signing up oh. you have to put your email uh put your first and last name your email and password and then you are going to be create account will be created for you and once account is created you need to then um, join the course you've paid for and that is it you start assessing all the courses or everything are going to be uploaded inside this course portal and that is where 
we try to make things organized um, as much as we can. Uh, I, I, some of us are being concerned about the content. The content will be here. You, we've used this course portal for for four years now, and it's good. That's that's all I can tell you. You know, I try. I'm, I'm a business analyst. I do research. I try to find out a scalable course um, technology that can take us for a long time and this is good so and then we have um a social media platform this social media platform we have been um i've been building this for a long time so and at this point we need to go to market at this point so So this is um, how, if you log inside here, this is it. We have everything that a social media can give to you. We have feed, we have uh, ad, we have um, marketplace. So the, the, the business model here is to help you connect you to the business around you business within your localities and friends within your localities so a lot of things here we have um, um blog you can create a very nice blog here uh, this is a blog in this so very good blog system we have a um, page you can have pages here can create your page. Um, this is my page. Even this our school will have a page here already. So this is our page here. So and we have a group. Can create group here. You can post job here. You can uh, offer here, and so many other things we can do here. You know. So if you are trying to look for friends or people around you, we can search for people based on proximity. You see, with this, this is distance if you make it like this. So the people that are going to share, if you are trying to look people closer to where you are, so this is the distance level we use. We can increase it or we can shrink it anyhow we want. And even businesses, you can look for businesses within the location using distance level here equally if you want to um manage your accounts here we have uh you can equally do monetization here this is money where you can monetize you know and start making money from the platform we virtually have everything social media have we have payments a wallet integrated here as well so and this is um a lot and this is where we have to try to uh scale up at this moment uh this is our wallet so somebody can you can um, fund your wallet and use your wallet here to make payment any product here people can you know uh upload products sell your products here if you look at it here you see uh a lot is going on here create products so from here you can sell goods anything you want to sell here and people can buy that is it so that is where we are going to be we can scream live video we can do a lot of things here so this is where we are, we are going to do our internship we are going to create because there's a lot of business activities going on here we need an enterprise resource planning to plan every of these activities and that is uh, please 
Bluetooth must be on mute. Uh, if, the, if this noise is coming from your end, so that is um, just a brief uh, introduction of how we are going to operate in this. Um, Aloba, I don't see why you are. Please, Aloba. Good. Okay. So that is um a brief a brief presentation of um what this boot camp is all about. This is what we've got to offer. Um, I don't know if, if we are short of your expectation or whichever way this is it, but if you give it a very good goal, I believe this package will perform um, above average every, anybody's expectation in this uh, boot camp. I've been in boot camp. And I try to give us something that can stand the uh, stand the test of time. So, so thank you. And this is opportunity for you to ask your questions. And I will start from the people raising hand. I will do it uh, from the first people, and we'll go down and we'll try as much as we can to. Capture everybody's view, question, whichever thing you want to ask at this moment, confusion or whatever, you are free to talk. We we respect everybody's view. Don't think uh, what you are saying or don't be discouraged. If you, there is something you want to talk, you talk about it. And when somebody is making a point, please, we don't um, try to, you know, laugh at a person. Every every everybody's view is very important. We respect that. So thank you. And I will start from Abimbola Irabo. Hello. Hi. Okay. Um, yes, my question is because in the previous um last uh session we had with you you made mention that your videos are very short like two hours which is very good but then it, uh and you also mentioned that we're going to have a learning platform here so what what are, my question now is are we going to watch the video then converge daily to talk about what we have been taught or i don't know how the delivery is going to be actually the delivery is like for instance, we are starting tonight. This uh, should be a lecture. Well, to, tonight is for induction. Going forward, at this point, you should be having your lecture. And after the lecture is recorded and uploaded. Within the lectures, uh, the lecture is going to be, for now, two days in a week. And within that period, we are going to give assignments or things for you to do or work on. So it's left for you to know how you do it. If you are having challenges, you can go back to the recorded video to assist you in doing your work. So that is how we do it. That's my question. Thank you. All right. And we have uh, Victoria IEC. Good evening, everyone. Okay, good, evening. Um, good evening, sir. Okay, so the thing is, I didn't get a chance to join the first section, but then I watched it, but I couldn't finish it because I was just able to join today. Um, I have a question for those of us who are not based in Nigeria. Is there a possibility we can also have our internship virtually? Yeah, you can have your internship virtually. Uh, because okay. uh, some of the is one of the reasons we are using 
our platform we are using makes it in such a way that anybody we can do our internship visually erp implementations we can do it visually you know it's not something but we try to have a blend is because it's good to network and in projects you know and um like I said already, you can do um, virtual internship. So don't worry about that. Okay, thank you very much, sir. Okay. Uh, for Alex. Yeah, good evening, everyone. Thank you, Mr. Uh, Charles, uh, for the orientation. Although I joined a bit halfway. Uh, during the course of the presentation, I heard you talk about uh, project management tools. Uh, most companies, if you observe, uh, project managers are expected to know uh, some tools that they work with, like um, uh, China, Modi.com, Trello, and others. So these tools, are they going to be, uh, this software, are they going to be part of the training that will be uh, like work with? Yeah, project management tool you can see within the curriculum is something we've captured. We know that we are going as a project manager, we need you need tools, you need software to do your job. So we're going to capture the most important ones. Like all these ones you mentioned, they are just one plot, asana, monday.com, trello, they are the same thing. So you are just going to use one. Company just going to use one. So in the company you cannot use so. If you get good knowledge of one, we'll try to scratch all of them. These are just, I meaning that is even not the major tool we're talking about. When we're talking about tools, we're talking about uh, projects, uh, tools like planners. We have um, uh, Microsoft projects, we have Project Libra. Um, these are the major tools which will help you to create your project plan. So all these ones you just mentioned are platforms which is still good. We are going to cover everything. So don't worry about that. Thank you. OK. And um, we have uh, Prisha uh, David. Hi, good evening, Prisha. Um, hello, everybody. Was, I'm really excited to be here. We've been waiting for days. Um, so something I want to ask is concerning the internship um, program. I know because we're based in several of us, we're based in different locations. Would, would we get to meet based on our location? Like me, I'm in Abuja. Would we have like boot session where Abuja people get yeah. to the Lagos people? Like yes, that? yes. Uh, uh, very soon, we are going to share a form where you are going to fill, indicate your location in the form. This will help us to group based on location. So these are in place. If you, although you, you are not following in, in, but this is what we do. That is how we are current, uh, currently running our program. We have groups scattered all over Nigeria. You know, this program is designed for Nigerians. And, you know, I have to be honest with you. But now we see a lot of people from, we have a class going on here in UK, you know, for those who live in UK. But I see so many of us here are becoming more interested. I know price is one thing that, um, because in UK, the price is high, you know. So, but don't worry, we are going to, even if you are not within the UK, we are going to, uh, or within Nigeria. That's why we are bringing a platform like, social media platform where you don't need to start going there to to manage maybe vendors like drivers or delivery men or things like that and again the application we are building is enterprise resource planning application we can do it 100 percent remote you know so these are the things um why we shouldn't bother you know so it's uh it's designed in such a way that everybody can be fully participated and the company 
is what we want to want to give a very global attention so that anywhere your um, employer try to search of look at whom we are we can stand out that will be good enough on your cv these are things have we put into consideration you know we believe in goodwill that is what we are doing now we don't i don't believe so much in money goodwill first well, once we have the goodwill we know money will come um mercy achi hello hello um, mr charles good evening can you, can you hear Hi. me yeah, yeah sure carry on okay so first of all um, i want to say i want to appreciate you for um this great presentation i think for me it was pretty um overwhelming thank you so much i'm grateful we're grateful okay i actually wanted to um ask a few questions over the same um internship because of course personality for those of us who reside like in lagos but i guess you've already answered the question already from the previous speaker who asked thank you sir um secondly please sir, i wanted to ask is in regards to because um i think there was a previous speaker as well who asked about where um the videos of the of the lectures if they're going to be um like posted or downloaded or something and then you said of course it's going to be uploaded on youtube so here's my question, just um, a little, you know, is it regards to for, like for some people who tends to have like data restraint and all of that due to maybe probably financial issues for them and all of that. So I wanted to ask, is there any possible means for us to download these videos and like maybe have it like in our Google Drive or just something like that, something that you can always go back to whenever you want to practice always? Just yeah, we don't do that. We upload our courses in... Um, in YouTube and make it available. For now, that is the standard we do it. Yeah, but we'll, maybe we'll think about that. But for now, that is the way we operate. Okay, sir. Okay, then lastly, please, sir, I want to really make reference to the issue of the noise, please. Um, um, I know you've always pleaded about like whenever you want to start a lecture, but we keep seeing a lot of people putting on their speakers. Like, I don't know if there's a way you can, when you, especially when the, the classes are to, like you want to start recording, can you, I don't know if there's a button or something you can click to unmute ev like mute everybody instantly because the constant noise that comes from some people their background is it's it's just a huge distraction to be honest and nobody's a child like i believe everybody should always try to know what the right things to do please if there's a way you can mute everybody i mean everybody instantly please then after the lecture you can you can allow the button to allow anybody to unmute themselves and ask whatever question they want to ask please yes, uh, the, no yes. the noises are disturbing the 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 platform every most of the video conferencing platform they have a mute yeah in this uh, we're using a uh, um google meet they have muted all muted like yeah so i'm going forward we'll see if we can have a, um um administrator that will be doing all this uh, managing the class while i'm doing the presentation we are taking uh, notice of all this, but we believe we are adults anyway. So when I'm dealing with adults, I try as much as I can to be a bit, you know, uh, free with them, not, you know, treating adults like kids. Although some adults are actually uh, try to misbehave, but yeah, we are going to find a way to come to a balance. God bless you, sir. Thank you. That's all. God bless. All right. Thank you. We have great to Beru. Great to Beru. Okay. It's like great is not here. We have a uh, full show. Good evening, everyone. This is great talking. Okay. Great. great well well we don't have time you know because i will have a lot of people raising their hands okay yeah i'm having network i'm having network challenge all right so okay, i want to ask although you answered one of my questions in the videos your question has been addressed
Okay, we have uh, Falarusha. Um, you can. Are you there? Good evening. Good evening, yeah. sir. Yeah. Good evening. Yes. Sir. Um. Thanks for the privilege given to me, and thanks for the orientation period. Uh, what I want to ask as uh, part of it has been answered, but I just want to lay emphasis on something. Uh, currently, I'm about to finish uh, a certificate in project management uh, from Enzyme College. Uh, but what uh, make me to do to register for these is uh, the first time the information and uh, which would be like the practical aspects because uh, the other one I'm having it's a uh, self learn and uh, hopefully I'm looking forward to see more practical ones now to back up the self learn the self learn uh, uh, program I've went through. So, and uh, from your orientation now, I know uh, I'm going to get a first hand uh, information and uh, practice. Thank you. And I'm hoping and looking forward to be a real project manager. Thank you. Okay. Like, um, if you have been following us, um, what we are packing here is enough to get you started, you know, give you the confidence. You know, before we even finish, I will have opportunity to ask you to start applying for job. Uh, you know, so so that while here you will be here, I want you to testify while you are here, not when you go out, so that I will be part of the people and everybody who people here will celebrate you. And this is what we're already witnessing in our current. Um, training you know a lot of people are already uh getting jobs and they are very excited i'm happy for them and it will happen here as well okay i have andrew emeka yeah good evening everyone uh mr charles thank you for giving me this great opportunity to speak on this platform um it's quite unfortunate that i wasn't able to join the last time but thank god i'm here now um i just want to ask this question i don't know if it has been addressed before um uh, i want to know the days of the program this is just my simple question thank you okay you know today is friday so yeah. we are going to make it in such a way it's going to be um thursdays and fridays i know because one thing is as other days are occupied you know and so many of my days i'm closing so many classes but especially here in uk so many of some classes are closing and this is going to free up my space where we might decide to add more days but for now it's two days um okay um thursdays and fridays 7 um pm to 8 uh pm so, uh, so a lot of you have been requesting for different time uh, frame, but the issue is that uh, we need to adjust our programs. There's no way we can come to uh, everybody's individual. So we, everybody we need to, one way or the other, make sacrifices. For me, seven to, to eight is okay. And we'll try as much as I can to to, to balance this but as we are as we are progressing we can adjust we can adapt we can you know it's not my class you know it's our class but i'm leading the so i try to make it open but it's not going to be too wide for us not to be able to 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 lead properly okay thank you very much i really appreciate it. all right thank you we have um she's some savior um hi good evening so um i think the, i just wanted to confirm because i don't really think i heard what you said um, correctly there so um the class i think i saw something about project management and business analysis but i wanted to know if we are taking both classes or at the point in time we would need to split. i just want to I, I didn't really get what you said there 
Yeah, we are going to take both classes. Yeah, but after taking the two classes, before you go for your internship, you have to choose one you want to practice. In that internship is either you are going to practice as a project manager or you are going to practice as a business analyst. But during the training is mandatory that everybody will have to take project management and everybody have to take business analysis. And when we start this training, you will see the reason. You see that project management or project managers cannot do with business analysts. And business analyst is a very good project manager. Okay, thank you very much. All right, we have um, Christopher, I have called you Christopher Anija. Have you spoken? Okay, I think Christopher is not um Gimeka Cindy. Hello, good evening. Oh. Hello, good evening. Oh. Okay, this is Christopher. Okay, Christopher, you can uh, talk please, now. Uh, let me... Okay, sorry, uh his network. Um I want to go straight, please. Um thank you for the opportunity once again. If you're not stable in a place due to work, uh, how do you try to because of the groupings that we are going to do are you going to um how are you going to manage that grouping for, uh, okay. for location sake we've handled that we we'll handle that issue so many times for instance if within this period you started from lagos and all of a sudden you have been transferred to abuja we will uh, put you we remove you from Lagos group and put you uh, in a, a, a Abuja group. Is that okay? Is that uh, answered? Y yes, sir. It's perfect. Thank you so much. So, like here, yeah, I've got some youth coppers in some states. I currently, I have a youth copper in Delta State. She finished her service in Delta State. Uh, she now want to go back to Lagos where her parents live and she's been active in Delta State but now she's living in Delta State. What do we do? We transfer her to, to Lagos to join Lagos uh, group to continue. It's one platform. We are one family. So thank you uh, so much. That's that's okay. Okay. Jinky Cindy. Okay, she's not here. We we'll have uh, a very okay, good evening, sir. Oh. Hello, good evening. Okay, carry on. Hello, can I... okay, sir. Please, I want to ask a question. Thank you for the class. Thank you for the opportunity. I want to ask a question. Like, I heard someone saying about a first class. Have you had another class apart from this class? First class, no, it's not. A, it's, yes. a, it's an open, open day before this session starts we had what we call open day open day is when people come we give people opportunity before you join this class or make payment for this class we give people opportunity to come and ask questions you know any kind of question confusing question that will help you to make decision if this uh, program is good for you we try to answer all the questions honestly not looking at um we are money. We are not a, we are in as much as we like everybody likes money, we are more interested in good name. So okay, no problem, sir. I'm just asking because I just joined the group a few days ago. Don't so worry, we are not this is the this is the official induction program induction meeting. So we are not missing okay, anything. Sir. And you can see yes, this induction is being recorded. So it's going to be shared. Everybody is going to get to watch it. And here we have um, Stephanie Ohi Omoba. Stephanie, okay, uh, you hey, Mr. Charles. Good evening. Good evening. Okay, Stephen. Stephen. Sorry, yeah. not Stephen. Stephen. Sorry, Stephen. Right. Um, 
quick question for for those of us who might want to go ahead to write the exams um do you have past questions or things that can guide us in the direction well which kind of exams perhaps CBAP. well we're, well we're not like here we are not i can help you based on um personal level to get it to 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 seek but this is not um we don't do it here we just concentrate on our structured program we are not guiding anybody to pass any particular exam like i said my business with you here is to help you get a job and after teaching i craft a cv that will help you to attract attention and help you with uh, cv preparation I tips on how to pass interview and look at making sure you get this job so about passing different exams we are not guaranteeing you that but we can any any material resources that can help you be happy if we lay our hands on that outside our own material we share them so that's fine thank you uh, but looking forward to getting more materials later all right okay ike chuku is there Aike, are you here? Good evening, everybody. Can you hear me? Yes, yeah, sure. Okay. I I want to appreciate uh, you for this uh, wonderful opportunity to learn under you. I have been a, a huge fan of you for like two years now. Thank but you. I'm happy today. Today I can talk to you one on one. Um, my own case is a, a case of switching career. I've been learning to switch to project management, and I think this is the best opportunity I have to do that. So, uh, my question is, um, you have really addressed it, but I wanted to know, is it the timing? Is it seven to eight or seven to nine? Is just one hour every day with me? Yeah, it's seven to eight, and you can see it's not only about the lecture. I okay. try to devote 30 minutes for interaction, like what we are doing now. This interactive activity is part of the learning where you understand the people you teach, you know, and okay. gather feedback from them. That feedback is like what I'm gathering here is called feedback. This will help me to give you a better service. It's very, very important in project management and business analysis. As a matter of fact, you are going to be a business analyst. You must learn how to gather feedback from the consumer of your product. So it's very important to us. We teach, but that feedback is important. I have to know how you feel. Thank you. And secondly, career switching is um, most people here have job, and a lot of people here don't have job. They are trying to get their first job. Good and fine. We are going to try to make everything happen. But career switching is very, very easy in this platform. You know, some of the students I handled um, three, four years ago, some of them are medical doctors. And one of the medical doctor, which is currently residing in UK now, she wasn't in UK before she was in, in Nigeria then. Today, project manager, after, after the training, immediately after the training, she got a job as a project manager. And she's combining that project manager job with her medical job. And lucky enough the, the project manager job is an american company so she must have finished her medical job you know we have different time zone so she managed to yeah. combine this job very well and according to her that project manager job give her the the kind of uh this is she really wanted and Today, she's in a very serious dilemma. She really wants to end her medical career to switch to project management full time, you know? And one of the guys I've been working side by side for a long time in the office is a registered 
medical doctor in this country and mm. today he, he don't want to even be called a medical doctor he's a, he's a senior business analyst doing well so career changing is very easy no matter it will give everybody opportunity to 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 have a new a new life a new dream will come through through it and this platform will make it happen i've seen it it's not that i'm it's not like i'm praying to that i've seen it has happened before me so many times i don't even remember that i studied finance i can't remember that so that's all i can tell you but the major magic you are going to do the magic okay all right. my, my second my second question is if he, 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 is there still opportunity for more people to pay because there's uh, somebody i'm waiting to join this program yeah if anybody uh, with, um, with joining that is not going to be very far away from now good but if because i would want I, I would want you to get a full benefit of every ten kobo you paid here or every penny you paid here you know even those that don't, doesn't pay me i try to every little time they invest in trying to follow me or listen to me i try to for them to get the full value of that they are better they pay in order to to listen to me so if they are not joining enough i will encourage them maybe wait for the next class because okay it's something we're building for the future we are not going away you know okay and we, we we want to even people from from here if you want to be part of our community if you are good enough and have joy in teaching if you finish and want to be part of my teaching crew good and fine so that is what i say good i think um ik let's um give others opportunity um lilian osuji okay kevin ebujo Okay, Mohammed Sanusi. Okay, Mohammed Sanusi speaking. Okay, Mohammed, you can have the floor. Yes, good evening, Mr. Charles. Um, good evening, everyone. So, uh, my name is Mohammed Sanusi speaking from Kano State. So I would like to know what qualifies someone to be um, a project manager, because um, you made mention of your students whom you advise to start as uh, project coordinators. So is there some sort of certifications, you know, that um, qualify someone to be a project manager? Yeah, for you, for you to be a project manager, from my own point of view, you must have finished my training and deliver some projects as a project manager you know you must have this life experience these people in my class currently they are still in the the, the, the boot camp is still ongoing they have not finished the boot camp but i know that what we've done is enough for them to become project coordinators project coordinator is an assistant project manager you know they are qualified to become project coordinator because they finish the training everything that they need to do they know it already and we've done some little projects which they participated so they can be called project coordinators and that's why i told them go submit your cv and project coordinators and they've submitted their cv and so many of them are getting jobs as project coordinators project planners project support officers but I told them you cannot apply. Some of them have gotten project manager job, maybe. But I, the, the point here is that I, I said, wait till you finish this bootcamp. By the time you finish this bootcamp, you must have handled projects 
under my watch as a project manager and then you can go out apply as a project manager and you have a cv that will contain that you have a work experience as a project manager in our company called gokabu so that is it so that is me that is what qualify you to become a project manager within our ecosystem so many institutions of uh, school of thought they have their own qualification but i do my own things my own way what matters is that we get results and so many people that have done it different ways they are not getting better result than us okay um thank you mr charles for that clarification thank you all right thank you um Kevin is the only person. Kevin, I think Kevin is the only person that I've not uh, spoken. Um, Ebere Dorothy, I've spoken. Ebere Dorothy, you've spoken, and uh, I've not spoken, sir. Okay, okay, oh, yeah. Carry the carry the floor now. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Charles. Good evening. All so, right. please, I want to ask: um, Is there any other WhatsApp group apart from the one I belong to? because I didn't get the link for this class. I have to call a friend of mine that will register together to send me the link. So I want to ask, is there any other WhatsApp group? Any, any other WhatsApp group? Yes, sir. Because I didn't get the link for this class. I have to call a friend of mine. We registered together. I called her to send me the link. So that was why I joined. So I want to know. Okay. Yes. Uh, the person that sent you the link, the, 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 the AQ is the person that compiled this. I'm taking over from it, but AQ is the person that managed it. I find out so many of you joined today. Maybe they didn't uh, have the opportunity to add you in the group, but let them know that you, uh, because I'm working with the list they give to me. So let them add you in the current group. We have a WhatsApp group we are using. Let them in mind. The WhatsApp group. Okay. Bear in mind, the last class I attended, I was there. But this particular one now, I didn't get the link. But I will, I will ask if we, I will chat her. The last class, when you make payment, I'm not the one coordinating this payment. I think once you make payment, they will transfer you to another group. Okay, okay. So let them All transfer right. you. Okay. Okay. Yeah, um, okay, thank you. Thank you for, for tonight's class. We are going to end here. Like, uh, I have a class starting by um, half eight. They're already calling me. I'm running behind schedule because, you know, this is uh, the first time we are meeting, and I really wanted to give you this opportunity to feel free to interact. So I'm just like 10 minutes behind schedule in my the other class. So we're just starting and uh, we're going to have a great time together. Thank you for tonight. Every other um, issues or any other thing that's bothering you, you want me to address, we'll have enough time to do that. Thank you and good night. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Have a good night. Thank you so much. 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 Th